Hello, I'm Larry Stoll from Pace Turf, and today I want to talk a little bit about the iPhone 4S that just came out and the personal assistant Siri and how she can help you with some of your turf grass management questions. What's handy about Siri is you don't have to type onto the cell phone, you can actually just speak to her and ask for a search on the internet for information that might be critical to you, such as pest identification questions and even some information about soil testing. What I want to show you in this short demonstration is how you can use Siri in conjunction with the Pace Turf website to find some of this critical information quite easily. Let's take a look and see how she does. Search the web for Pace Turf Diseases Photo Index. Searching for Pace Turf Diseases Photo Index. Siri finds a couple of uh, listings. There's the main gallery index at the top and then the disease photo index which simplifies looking up these disease images. This is a listing of the major diseases and if you just uh, select one of the diseases, for example brown ring patch, it'll pull up the uh, images, the thumbnails and descriptions that you can select from the images to uh, see what you'd like to uh, uh, investigate. And in this case, if we magnify the image, we can see it is the uh, septate hyphae with right angle branches that are typical for wadia and the other rhizoctonia species. Let's try uh, something else. Search the web for Pace Turf Soil Guidelines. Sometimes it takes a minute, depending on uh, how fast your internet connection is. Uh, Searching working. for Pace Turf Soil Guidelines. And then you'll see we have uh, some soil guidelines here we can open up, and it will give you um, a general rundown of uh, soil guidelines uh, that you can uh, look at and uh, get an idea for the uh, various uh, elements in the system. Uh, similar things, uh, similar searches can be run on uh, tissues. Search the web for Pace Turf Tissue Guidelines. Searching the web for Pace Turf Tissue Guidelines. And we can see there's a printable version of uh, a report which uh, talks about uh, tissue guidelines and uh, pros and cons of using tissue analysis uh, and some details on uh, what you would expect to see uh, in tissues uh, using uh, box plots for nitrogen, phosphorus, uh, for example, and a variety of other uh, tissue uh, characteristics. We even have uh, search the web for Pace Turf Water Guidelines. Searching the web for Pace Turf Water Guidelines. Similar situation. Uh, key parameters and guidelines which uh, you'd expect to have problems um, problems with uh, using those uh, waters containing various levels of uh, elements. And we can get even a little bit more technical with some of the requests. Uh, search the web for Pace Turf Soil Chloride and Sulfur Guidelines. Searching the web for Pace Turf Soil Chloride and Sulfur Guidelines. And we have a variety of um, uh, possibilities here, but this is the proposed guidelines for uh, sulfur and chloride. It's a very small table, but it's uh, basically POA uh, bent uh, rye slash Bermuda to give rough ideas on the guidelines you can use uh, for sulfur uh, and chloride as uh, mainly the factors that are influencing uh, soil electrical conductivity. Here's another search that might be helpful. Find or search for Pace Turf Diagnostic Laboratories. Searching for Pace Turf Diagnostic Laboratories. And this provides just a listing of laboratories that we feel are do a good job in diagnostics uh, from around the country, most uh, associated with uh, universities that you can use to send uh, samples in for analysis. I hope you enjoyed this short video on how you can use your new iPhone and Siri to help you find information without having to type on the keypad. 
uh, in the field. So this is a pretty nice little uh, tool for turf grass managers. Uh, we hope you enjoy it and hope you use it in conjunction with the Pace Turf website. And of course, uh, Pace Turf is a member supported website. Uh, there, we have no advertising, so if you aren't a member, we'd encourage you to uh, join and support the effort to get great information out to turf grass managers. Thanks for your time, and we hope you enjoy this video.